Hello and welcome back to another Let's Play. Uh, this is Acts of these are Acts of Kindness, and this is Subnautica. Uh, I haven't recorded in a while. Uh, actually, upgraded my laptop, got some new games, obviously. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right in here. You can see I've got another game that I tested out just to make sure. Um, I actually played on this same laptop for about seven hours. I got to the gun island. Um, I'm sorry, spoiler. Um, got, we got to the gun island and the computer locked up on me completely. I had to do a hard reboot and uh, I, I don't know what happened. It must have fried something, but uh, the screen wouldn't come back. So, you know, I had to go out and exchange it for another laptop. I got the same model, so let's hope that that doesn't happen. Um, if this video doesn't get posted, then, well, you'll know then, I guess. Or you won't, because you won't see it. Oh, let's go ahead and... forgot to set my timer here. As we're waiting for this thing to load. I mean, it's not a desktop, so it's not going to load the quickest, but it is a pretty fairly powerful laptop for the price range. I only spent a thousand dollars on it. About. Launch in three, two, one. Okay. Ooh, there we go. So I, uh, I actually have this game on Xbox One as well, and uh, we have a fairly developed game going. I won't, uh, I won't give away any spoilers, but uh, this won't be my first rodeo. Um, please let me know if you would like for me to adjust any settings sound settings or anything else like that. Um, hopefully the frame rate and graphics are not that bad. Um, I like the draw distance. It's not too bad compared to the Xbox One. I actually think the this version on this laptop is probably a little bit better looking. And I've noticed that some of the recipes are also a little bit different as well, so I don't know how much difference that'll be, especially when we get into the, some of the more advanced recipes. Alright, let's, uh, let's get to it. Let's go ahead and start collecting resources so we can kind of get get to the survival point the Aurora Sunbird orbital pile failure cause unknown zero human life signs detected I guess we'll go ahead and grab some wreckage we'll get some titanium going real quick we don't want to go too crazy with it oh, let's get some copper please copper there we go is an essential component of all powered equipment your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely. Alright, we don't want to go towards the Aurora. We want to go away from it. Oh, look at that. Is that something to scan already down there? Look at this, some sandstone. Nice. Eh, I don't know how useful that lead was, but... Let's go ahead and grab some creep vine clusters. So we can make some fins. I hate swimming slow like this. Now if we get uh, the right amount of stuff... We'll get one more. One more. Come on. There we go. Oh, I guess we got two more. If we get some silver... If we get some silver... We can go ahead and build the uh, 
high capacity tank. I know we need some quartz for that too, and some glass. Um, there's some more copper. Um, doo -doo -doo. We definitely want to go looking around in the in the forest over here for some more sandstone. Ooh, that's just what I wanted to see right there. Nice big coral cave, I guess you would call it. Grab some quartz. Oh, that's where I need to go, right in there. I saw three sandstone. One more, I think, will be good. Um, yeah, let's go for some air. And then we'll come back, go through that cave real quick. I don't know if I needed the veined nettle. I'll probably end up dropping that. Oh, no boom fish, no boom fish, no boom fish. Yeah. There we go. I think that's all I needed two silver and one gold. Ugh. What's my inventory like? Okay, let's go back. We'll make some fins, at least an air tank. Maybe even make that glass, see if we can do the high capacity. We can always go back for some more if we need it for lubricant. We need to go get it for uh, the fibers anyways. Um, let's see, what do we need? Okay. Boom. High capacity tank. It's it's almost really essential to get the high capacity tank as soon as possible so you can really start doing some deep dives and getting stuff going. Um, don't know if I want to do the locker. Let's do the knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. Let's the do some batteries. The only exception. And we'll do copper wire. Applied. Okay, I don't think that means we can make anything except for the scanner, I guess. Which is good, we can start scanning stuff too. The there we go. Oh, I used all the power. To record alien biological data. Okay. <clears throat> now we don't have a flashlight. So where was that cave at? I need more quartz. We will need a couple of these. Ah! 
I've seen these fall through the ground before. Nah, I think four should be good for right now. You know what? Just in case. I'll grab one so that we can make uh, one of those air pouches. Ooh. Yeah, let's get some air real quick. Let's go down. See if there's anything to scan. Looks like there's a bunch to scan. I've never made any of these grab traps. I wonder if they're worth it. Oh, if we can get a sea glide right off the bat too. Oh man, it's done. Might as well get some air, scan some stuff. back in the distance. Man, we're going to lose our light here soon. Oh, no, that's not it. Darn it. Well, I don't know what we can really do in the dark. Oops. <clears throat> Sorry, that's not my... Uh... You know what? We'll get some more... We'll get some fiber mesh. We'll just get as much as possible. <laughs> ah, it's a rabbit ray. Ah, almost there we go. You know, I have rabbits. That actually looks a lot like a rabbit. Oh, I got my breakfast over there and I didn't even eat it. Uh, what did we get? We got fish? I don't know. No, we did not. Oh, I can get the rebreather already? Wow. Get the air bladder. I guess I could take maybe no. We'll just go scan some stuff out. Get the Gary fish. Sure, I'll follow you to the surface. Look at that moon. God, it's so close that it just like flies across the sky. <clears throat> Let's see, what do we need? We need quartz. 
We could do definitely do more copper. Maybe sand some stuff. Should have made a light, maybe. Yeah, I noticed that uh, the recipes, the compass in Xbox One takes magnetite, whereas on the PC it doesn't. Could this be a cave? Ah! Ow. Looks like I found my sulfur though. Nice. Veined metal. Some titanium. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, some copper, just what I needed. I even have air right at the mouth of the cave. The sun's coming up nicely. Let's go check out this cave a little bit more. Detecting the increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core. Oh no. During planet fall. Not damage to the drive core. Really not stoked about titanium, but absolutely on the quartz. Maybe there's some sandstone over here. I should grab some salt. Check my inventory. See what we can do. Oh, yeah. These stalkers used to scare the crap out of me. Because you can't really see them. So they're right on top of you. Hey, I'll take that tooth. Oh, look. Two teeth. Wow, that was a lucky find. I see this box over here. These two boxes. Mobile vehicle bay. One more. <clears throat> and we will need that for the um, the sea moth and stuff. Okay. Just looking around, looking for stuff to scan, 
some resources, maybe. Just maybe, though. Need to make another pass through that cave, or just try to find more quartz in general. And see, this is what I mean about getting the high capacity tank. Like, you could literally spend days down here once you get the tank. swimming at this point. <laughs> I'm not seeing any more boxes. You know what? I'm going to go down there because there's going to be quartz. probably going to wrap this episode up here in the next few minutes. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need need the light down here. Darn. Well, I could make the light. Let's start heading back that way. Okay. Yeah. We will end the episode when we get back to the capsule pod. Ooh. Ooh, come on, Sea Glide. Yeah! Yeah! We are gonna make a Sea Glide when we get back. Stalker 2? Stalker 2? Anyone? I ain't grabbing your wreckage, bro! Hey, I'm stoked that we got the Sea Glide, at least. Looks like there's something right here, too. Probably another Sea Glide piece. I'll take the Titanium. I should probably go up, though. Yeah. <clears throat> yep, we got a bunch of stuff to make, uh, but that'll be in the next episode. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and call it there. Thank you for joining me. I hope you'll tune in next time to another Subnautica uh, episode.